We are looking past several stars sitting on our nose in our own Milky Way galaxy. These are the spiked objects that are here. Ignore them. Okay. They're just in the way. Okay. All right. What we're actually looking towards is a galaxy cluster halfway to the edge of the universe. Have you ever pondered the mysteries that linger within the fabric of our universe? Picture this, a cosmic ballet where stars and galaxies waltz through the vast expanse, each movement revealing a secret of the cosmos. Imagine an advanced telescope that can unveil these secrets, pulling back the curtain on celestial wonders. This telescope, the James Webb Space Telescope, has garnered the attention of the zealous astrophysicist Neil deGrasse Tyson. Galaxies behind it, these that are curved into arc shapes, they're light passing through the universe, minding its own business. It sees this distortion in the fabric of space and time, and it curves in response to it. There, there Einstein be, predicted this. There. As we stand on the brink of discovery, Tyson's excitement mirrors our curiosity. The telescope offers us a glimpse into the enigmatic Orion Nebula, a cradle of stellar birth, and introduces us to peculiar celestial wanderers, the Jupiter-mass binary objects, or jumbos. These jumbos, drifting freely without astral ties, defy our understanding of planetary formation. But why does this discovery captivate us? Why do these celestial enigmas beckon us into the realm of the unknown? Join us as we journey through the telescope's revelations, guided by Neil Tyson's passion, unraveling the tales of jumbos and diving deeper into the cosmic unknown. Neil Tyson, the avid astrophysicist, is all in for the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, embracing the cosmic revelations it offers. With NASA sharing images and data, the JWST unlocks celestial mysteries unprecedentedly. One captivating image has Neil's attention, a view beyond our galaxy's interfering stars into a galaxy cluster halfway to the edge of the universe. Gravitational forces at play bend and twist light from galaxies, creating a captivating space-time dance. This discovery is colossal, entire galaxies dwarfing our Milky Way captured within a grain of sand's view at arm's length. The intricate detail is mind-boggling, challenging our understanding of the cosmos. Think about that. This entire telescope is tuned for the infrared. Ah, you can't see okay. infrared. Okay. But what the telescope does is it can take images in three different bands, separate bands of the infrared. Then you hand it an RGB and create a color picture, which is the color you yeah. would see if your eyes could see infrared. Oh, wow. Neil elucidates the peculiar spiked appearances in some images. These are not cosmic anomalies, but hardware peculiarities. The JWST's infrared prowess delves deep into gas clouds, capturing the birth of stars and their planetary systems. The colors depicted are an amalgamation of various infrared lights, simulating how our eyes might perceive infrared. This legitimate representation is swiftly achieved in just 10 seconds. Yet, amidst this excitement lies an enigmatic discovery, Jupiter-sized planets drifting freely in space, unrelated to any star. They come in pairs, puzzling astronomers. Could these be born in regions with insufficient material for full-fledged stars? Or were they initially formed around stars and then expelled into interstellar space through complex interactions? The favored hypothesis leans towards ejection, challenging existing understanding. Neil Tyson's enthusiasm for this discovery propels us to dig deeper into the enigma of these Jupiter-mass binary objects, or jumbos for short. As we ponder this discovery, we're left questioning the fundamental laws governing planetary formation. The jumbos beckon us to explore the uncharted territories of our understanding, reminding us that the universe is a realm of endless wonder and astonishment. Neil Tyson's excitement for the James Webb Space Telescope's discoveries mirrors our yearning to fathom the depths of the cosmos. 
The telescope's unparalleled resolution and infrared sensitivity open a window into the enigmatic Orion Nebula. This cosmic vista, a mosaic of 700 views captured over a week, is a tapestry of young stars. Ranging from 40 to less than 0.1 times the mass of our sun, these nascent stars are surrounded by swirling disks of gas and dust, the cradles of potential new planets. Yet, amidst this celestial nursery, the jumbos steal the spotlight. Around 40 pairs of Jupiter-sized planets in free orbit challenge our understanding of planetary formation. Are these divine twins born from sparse nebular regions or the aftermath of gravitational dances with stars? Professor Mark McCoffrian, at the helm of the Orion Survey, admits that this discovery defies established models. The prevailing ejection hypothesis baffles scientists, leaving us with more questions than answers. As we venture deeper into the Orion Nebula, we grapple with the implications of these binary celestial wanderers. They compel us to reevaluate our understanding of the cosmos, encouraging theorists to craft new narratives that may unravel this enigmatic dance of heavenly bodies. The jumbos stand as a testament to the universe's complexity, a reminder that surprises await even in the well-explored realms of space. In the heart of this cosmic revelation, we find ourselves captivated by the jumbos, Jupiter-mass binary objects, mysteries hidden within the Orion Nebula. As we stand on the brink of understanding, questions loom large. How do these binaries, akin to Jupiter in size, find themselves adrift in the vastness of interstellar space? The prevailing theories wrestle with the birthplaces of these enigmatic entities. Could they have originated from regions in the nebula where the material density fell short of star formation? Or they were once in stellar company, only to be cast out into the cosmic sea? The favorite notion, the ejection hypothesis, perplexes our understanding of planetary system formation. The binary synchronized drifting defies conventional wisdom. As we grapple with this celestial riddle, the excitement surrounding the James Webb Space Telescope's findings reaches a crescendo. Neil Tyson's enthusiasm mirrors our own, for within these mysteries lies the promise of uncovering the unknown, challenging our notions of the cosmos. With each passing moment, astronomers and theorists work diligently, driven by the allure of unraveling these mysteries. The jumbos remain a tantalizing enigma, a reminder that in the boundless expanse of the universe, there are still celestial secrets waiting to be unraveled. We await further revelations as the James Webb Space Telescope continues its cosmic gaze. The jumbos beckon us to keep exploring, questioning, and reaching for the stars.